Good morning, everyone. Um, good morning, getting it's morning for me. I hope everybody's doing good today. Doing a little bit of an early stream because I'm going to be up tonight and I wanted to stream, so here we are. Bill Maxwell, wanted for the bodily assault of a U.S. federal marshal. Well, we just can't have people going around messing with the law and getting away with it. Got it heading all the way back over to Valentine. Let's just go to Valentine and see what Mr. Bill Maxwell's got going on. Dum -da -dum -da -dum -dum. Nothing like a nice smooth ride up and down the train track. Make you realize that you really miss having shocks on a horse. I leave the faucet on again, it is raining. I hate it when people leave the faucet on. Doesn't it look like a friendly gunfight? Because interestingly enough, in 1899, gunfights were actually legal. Which is so funny, as long as you challenge someone for whatever reason, you walk out the street and handle it by a certain set of rules, you could actually shoot somebody and kill them and get away with it. That's a train. We're going to ease right over here.
happen really too much. Shoot between the cracks. Somebody out there, where are you? <laughs> oh no, you're going to regret this. That would you. You really shouldn't have messed with. Now, which one of you people? Oh, thank you. Yeah. You got antique alcohol. Definitely a good thing. I don't think you should just be walking around with a bottle of antique alcohol in your pocket. And evidently, I just want to put them in the mud. Go. Where are we taking you to? Valentine, just right up. Hold up with that wagon. I've got to drop this prisoner off. Get clear. Well, you can hold on just a minute. This right here is a dangerous desperado. I mean, he's dead, but he's dangerous. It said dead or alive, and I don't mind keeping things simple. Oh, it said live on the poster? I can't read that far. I got to get this person dead, so I did. I hear jingle bells. But it's this one up here on the back, back here. Yep. Hey, Rocket. Good to see you. Oh, I like, I like it. The rabbit and the magnifying glass. I'll have to start using that. Yeah, we're just doing a little bit of early morning stuff because I'm going to be out of town tonight. So I thought I'll stream during the day. Right now I'm just trying to get my hands warmed up because I ain't been awake long. Wanted for unlicensed distillation and sales of spirit. Arthur Swindle. Okay, I want to go after him just because of his name. But there is nothing wrong with making some alcohol and selling it. That is... You know, pretty much what everybody did back then. So let's see. Cleveland Moore. Having murdered two prison guards while in transit, infamous bootlegger Cleveland Moore is now a fugitive and at large. Okay, so we got two bootleggers. One is just wanted for the unlicensed distillation and sales of spirit. Nothing wrong with that. Now the other one's a bootlegger, so they're selling or making spirit. But he killed two prison guards. Okay, we're going after Cleveland. All right, let's go get him. Oh, you can stop. I'm not. Aha, I beat the train. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, 
as we ride across the nice open terrain as the western frontier we wonder can I leave this stove on? Where in the world oh, is the Heartland Overflow? Let me back up this way. Yeah, it's hard to believe whenever they actually uh, oil drilling back in 1899, they didn't have like big tanks and stuff they put it in. They just pump it out into a hole that it dug out in the ground and then put it in, use buckets to put it in the barrels. Ooh, buffalo. So pretty. Right, moving on. Dun, 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 dun. Sometimes you Sometimes you just have to stop and enjoy the digitally rendered world. Yeah. You're headed straight up that way. Let that player pass by. Good deal. Hmm. So he's missing. So we're going to have to do an investigation. Alright, house hop off. Where's my clue? There's my clue. Hmm, a burned out wagon beside a fire. It's like somebody got a little bit too close to their party, just a little too hard. There's no way we're going to have one clue and get it on the first try. That is not going to happen. Hey horse, when I say stop, stop. Not listening today. Hmm. Broken wagon wheel. That's one way to dismount. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> you can see the footprints in the mud after I inspected where he walked off. That's funny. Somebody came this way. We're going to follow the footprint. Good turkeys. Ah.
down. The grass is about as tall as the horse. are out this oh is that them there they are right there under the tree get a ran mister oh why did that not hit Oh, you're not really good at this hiding thing. There's a girl on a white horse dressed in solid white. With the moon in my eyes and the moon to your back. And you couldn't see me? I want to kill you just for that. A bolo laying somewhere out here. Oh well. You puny woman. I may be puny, but uh, who's the one that's tied up there, buddy? Hey, watch this. Uh, shoot her power. That's right. Oh, oh, there it is. Got my bolo back. I always love how they tell you, how, like, you know, you're puny, you're scrawny, I'm gonna do this when they're the ones tied up on the back of a horse. Oh, you gonna see me again. Well... My horse had a party last night, so she's probably going to fart here in a minute. And yes, I'm purposely riding through a bit of water. There we go. Still breath in this one's lungs. Yeah, I know it's strange. Normally I bring them in dead even if they come willingly. Nice. That's a good one. Good little starter. Right, let's go visit, uh... Hmm. Yeah, let's go see if he's got anything for us today. You know, he's he's completely off his rocker. He's more nuts than I am. I know I'm insane. He doesn't know it. That's what's scary. Hey, buddy. How's it going? You seen the Italian, huh? Yeah, I did. Work for that lion sack of snakes. Well, I'm working for you, and you're working for him. So who's who's who here? Don't be pointing fingers. You've been doing good for me, almost too good. Yeah, I know. I'm good at my job. Oh, paid killing right up my alley. Well, good. You're a killer. Uh huh. And that's what I need right now. Someone will see it through. And won't back out. There are some fellers up at Pleasant. Part of a gang of crazies. Right. And these boys are killers too. Right. No mistake. Uh-huh. Okay. So you better be better. 
Okay. We get the jump. Survival. Survival is all that matters. You know, if there was zombies around right now, he would be awesome in this part. Go on now. Why does Joe have a kid's toy in his house? You know, that's interesting. That might explain why he's kind of woohoo like he is. Got the kid's pulley horse. Go, uh, give me, forgive me a minute. I want to look around here. Why well, you got a ladder laying? No need to hang around here. The ladder up to a loft. It looks like it's just full of stuff. But typically, that's up there. The loft area would be where the bed, like a sleeping quarters, would be. There's a spot up there. There's one up there, too. Huh. Makes you wonder if Joe might have had a family at one time and they got killed and he just went completely off his rocker. Or what if he actually had a family and he killed them and he is off his rocker? And we're going to switch. And we're going to go bounty mode. Let's go have some killing fun. Dun, 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 dun. Hope everybody's enjoying the stream, having the fun. It's kind of a casual early morning. We just rambling, having some fun. I'm gonna be doing a big long live stream tomorrow. Actually, probably a double header with some Red Dead and some Fallout 76. This morning, I'm just now drinking my morning coffee, so it's kind of a meh morning. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Why do they always want me to go all the way around the map to get from point A to point B? Don't want to get. I don't want to firefight up here. I want to be around at more of an open area so they can't sneak through the brush. There we go. See? Hey, Rocky. How's it going? Just playing a little Red Dead this morning casually. Having some fun. I will shoot you in the butt. I don't care.
Oh, you want to run? No, 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 no. You're just going to die tired. Come back here, buddy. Yes, today is gun day, so I can have a lot, be a lot more aggressive. Well, you should have done that a lot faster, buddy. What you got on you? Oh, a gold wedding ring. I think he has a missus somewhere that's waiting on him that's never gonna come home. Y'all should know not to run for me. I don't make promises. I make widows. What you got on you? You got a Mrs. Wait, that's never going to see you? No, you just got some money. Hey, what about you? How are you? That's a nice scarf you got on. Yeah, what you got? What you got? What you got? Eleven cents. You got some broke people. Ooh, gold pocket watch. And look, it stopped at exactly the time you got shot. Amazing. Oh, and a silver emblem ring. Now that. <laughs> I hear it. Oh, what we got here? Oh, it's a, just another tarot card. Evidently, they don't read tarot because that card would have said, Run! All right, good deal. So that was a good little... Blood money mission. Definitely worth it. Let's see here. We got some benefits from Rockstar. Probably auto, probably generic auto one. The double rewards on select free war roam. Okay, well, we just did that. Hardcore telegraph. And nothing new. Hey, is that a player? I don't want to shoot a player. Hey, what you what you got in the what you got in the wagon? Hey, Mister, what you got in the wagon? Okay. Oh, I'll just take a look myself. Oh, you didn't see nothing, buddy. Keep on going. Keep on going. I told you. Could have kept on going. You know that thing on your back? You should have used that. What you got? See? Had antique Tennessee whiskey. Yep. Yep. I knew it. All right, let's go see what Joe, if Joe's got us another, something another to do. Dun, 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 dun. Am I even heading, heading towards Joe? That way. There we go. Uh, 
Dun, 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 dun. Whoa! Oh, that's that was one of the people that took out. Nothing like a good fresh can of unwarmed beans to make you feel great about being on the trail. We really need to get service. Hey, dun 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 dun. Service. Service. There you are. Oh, no, no, I won't sit. Dead gummit. I hate it when the controller sometimes doesn't acknowledge that I've made a choice. And since we're wearing all black, we can actually play, you know, dishonorable. But we don't have to be nice to people. There we go. Uh oh, I see smoke. Somebody might need some help over there. There's Cerebus. Perfect, perfect look for being dishonorable. Oh yeah, everything's going good, Rocky. I just, I've been uh, going out of town like last few nights and be out of town tonight so I'll be streaming today. Uh oh. Don't make me kill all these idiots myself. Yeah. Oh y'all no y'all need some help here let me help you. Yeah. Really you gonna ride around straight into me? I'll blow your face off. Oh you will You ain't doing nothing but riding around. Anybody else want some? Oh, do you like some? Here, you have a couple. How about you? I shouldn't have come here. Anybody else? I don't know who these people are, but they're my friends. Don't just ease up on somebody like that. You at least walk up acting all friendly and say, Hey, got any food? Give me some stew. And then when they're not looking, you stab them in the back. That's how you do it. Oh, we completed a daily challenge. Good deal. Hey, Joe, it's Ani. Joe, you in there? Joe! Hey, it's me.
Yeah. Sure, I didn't. We're still friends. You still look like you've been hit by a train. You've been doing good for me. Almost too good. Yeah, I know. It's almost like I know what I'm doing, I which I don't. Life was simple. Just how it ought to be. Oh, I hate working for these Europeans. Ooh, what's this? Blackmailer. And a liar. That's who he is. Your new master. Mm -mm. Ooh, I like that one. Hey, what if I told you there were some real low lifes? What if you did? Bad folks. They're bad. Worse than me. Ain't nobody worse than you. All camped out in the middle of nowhere. Nowhere. And they got a stash with them. Right, a mustache. A stash. A big mustache. Some of your beloved Capitale too. Okay. You already made up your mind. Yeah, I'm waiting for you to shut up. They're as good as dead. They're already dead. That's what I like about you. I don't care. Spin a little yarn and off you go. Unless you make a sweater without yarn. Questions asked. <laughs> what is there to ask? Go here, kill people, steal stuff, come back. Pretty simple. Yeah, I like those terms. Ooh, the night sky. Stars. Well, but in the words of that very, very intellectual person, let's get her done. And an end. It's the middle of the night, the moon's out, you look up and there's a shadow of a black rider on a black horse sitting on a hill looking at you. And nobody thought to raise an alarm. And this is perfectly natural. Even the bird flew away because it knew what was coming. One of you six and take off running, and that one's gonna die. It's, that's what I thought. Good deal. So now the snitch it's the snitch ain't getting away. That other one. Good deal. We still got fourteen minutes. Where is that capital? There it is. Incense. Woohoo! We can afford a thing of soda. Or is it pop? I really should have just left well enough alone. Mates always got to stick their nose in business. Don't involve them. Pick some berries. 
Where are you? Oh, there you are. Got anything? Good deal. Alright, service. Let's go turn this in. I don't know. Are you dead yet? Goodbye. Have a nice trip. See you next fall. It's actually really, really easy. I'll just go in here and throw this down at the old. Right, and I think we are good to. After this, we will pick us up a call to arms. Let's head to camp, make sure I'm full on ammo, and we will do, uh, let's do black water. I really like black water. Dun, 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 dun. Hey, Blemo! my camp now. There we go. Oh, we've also got moonshine ready. So yeah, we will go run the moonshine first and then get it started back and then do our call to arms. That'd be perfect. Saw that it just ran up on it. Which one is this? Eight of Wands. We still have Jingle Bells. We do, so what's around that? Is that a Cardinal? Oh god, I hate Cardinal flowers. They're every freaking where. <clears throat> hey Mario, you got my moonshine ready? We can ship it whenever you like. Well, how about I like it right now? Yeah, hello ZT. I'm gonna shoot you. Alright, let's see. Is anybody wanting some of this? Yes. Right. Hell Baker. Ah, I was wondering when you were going to get here. It's Appleberry crumbs on my head. It's it. all good batches, but this one is superior. They're all superior. You found a buyer. I found the buyer. Will pay for it too. Now all you have to do is to be attentive. Eh? 
Danielle, can you get pizza? I've never busted more than one bottle. It was because you packed it wrong. She is so arrogant. I'm out here doing all the work, risking my life, getting shot at, and all he has to do is make moonshine. He sleeps most of the time. Get out of my way. Move it. What I thought. Got me out here on this road with all these wild people and animals and... Oh wait, never mind. I'm me. <laughs> They're more afraid of me than I am of them. And of course, it is not obvious at all that we have moonshine in the wagon. I mean, you can look in the back right there. You cannot see any moonshine. No, that's all um, spring water. Yeah, spring water from the Fountain of Youth in La Gras. Yeah, that's what it is. Oh, there's a revenue agent. Dun, 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 dun. Well, that was a bad idea. We're going. Maybe going the wrong way, but we're going. Sorry boys, should have let me go. Did you your kneecap? But that's gonna hurt. He has to get shot in that arrow with the knee, or can it be a bullet to become a guard in white rain? But if it's a bullet, you can, if you can get shot in the knee with a bullet, then that guy just became a guard in white rain. The one at the front gate, to be a matter of fact. It was a dark and scary night when she came out of the shadows. Shooting people in the kneecaps. I see you riding up behind me. Come on, buddy. We ain't got time to waste talking. Talking will get you killed.
There you go, mister. Oh, I'm so glad you paid so promptly. I hate killing the buyers. Alright, let's... Now we can go to camp, resupply, and do our call to arms. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, we want to head to camp. There we go. And I hope everybody's doing good on this, what is it, Saturday? First thing we're gonna do is we're gonna we're gonna make some stew. We're gonna let Chris take credit for it because obviously he doesn't know how to cook. I know, Cribs, I made it. Jeez, why do you always, why do you always have to narrate everything I do? Like he's a player. I'm gonna talk about everything you do as if I've done it. Ashram, we'll get you. There's food in there. Here, get the plate. There you go. There we go. Resupply. Good. Good. All right, we're good on everything. Oops. All right, and did that one get reloaded? Yep, those reloaded. All right, let's do this. We're gonna do a call to arms, and we're gonna do black water. Get a load. Perfect. Call to arms, black order. Send black order from the attack. Oh, I thought we were attacking the attackers. It'd be awesome if you could do that. See, that would be an awesome. Hey, Rocket. <laughs> and see, that would actually be an awesome uh thing that they could that they should have implemented is have a kind of a call to arms, but have two teams. You've got one defending team. And then you've got a, an attacking team. So, you know, the defending team's got the NPCs helping. And then you could be part of the attackers. And so have team, you know, team versus team. Kind of like a deathmatch. Yeah, team versus team deathmatch. That would have been awesome. Yeah, I come in guns drawn. I'm here to help. Yeah, that's not threatening. All right. Uh, I didn't know what was coming. Well, I'm not. Crazy, but we'll take it. Well, I'm not really here, okay, per se. But I mean, I would kill all of y'all if I was given the chance, just so you know. But like you, uh, you, I don't like. You. 
Mm -hmm. Let's go get a gun in my hand. There we go. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take you. Yeah, you're coming with me, buddy. Come in. Where you at? Hey, come on up. Oh, what are you doing that? At least you're guarding the bottom of the ladder. Where are you going? Well, he just flat out is like, no, I'm not doing this. So I'm like, okay. Dun -dun -dun -dun. <laughs> he just shot right up in the air. He's dead. Right, come here. Hey, Tommy Cat! Yeah, I definitely think that NBC is afraid of heights. Sometimes you should just stay laying down. Yeah, that's why I don't want to be on the ground. Because I run into barrels all the time. Really, you're going to hide behind the power pole? I mean, that's something I would do, but... You're going to stay behind it. Whoa! Somebody said hello. And then he fell down. Anybody else? Oh, there you are. Here, let me just walk right up here. Hey, how you doing? Thank you. Where you at? And we That's a feature uh, Dismount Where he always is Oh there you are It's because there won't be one. 
Good job, everybody. Good job. Way to go. We'll go ahead and get some ammo up over here. Dun, 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 dun. There's an ammo box. There's an ammo box. Thank you, thank you. There we go. That got us back up. Yeah, we're good now. Right, 32 scoundrels to take care of. I'm done for, really. You didn't even got here yet. How do you know? Thanks. Oh, if I'm done for, why are you laying in the dirt? You better bring some friends with you, because obviously those two didn't know what they were doing. Give it a good call. Let's try. Come on, you can do it. Good try. That's a really good try. I mean, I'm proud of you. Are you going to try it too? Okay, come on. It will. You did. I like that pirouette. That was really nice. Oh, you will? Like that? Oh, I am? I just, I'm just not feeling it. All these promises and nobody can fulfill it. Here, maybe you can. You doing good? You will. Kind of like that. What about like that? Anybody else? Feeler? Feeler? Anybody else? Oh, there you are. Thanks for volunteering. There we go. Where in the world are you shooting from?
Yeah, well, you're the one hiding behind the side of the building over there. Okay. Take your dad. <laughs> oh, no worries, Rocket. You're good. And don't worry, I keep the snacks and drinks all completely stocked under the stairs so that way everybody's comfortable. I do not mind. My spider hangers. I actually do the same thing a lot of times. I'll join people with streams, but then like I'm cleaning house or whatever, so I'm just listening, so it's not a problem. Yeah, here we go on round three. Hey, we got an oil leak. Haha, <laughs> that's funny. See what we got here. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I'll ask you that. Yeah, bury you face down. The fog's rolling in. I think I'm getting sighted in. Got that one guy. Yeah. <laughs> well, unfortunately, they did. The, the, you know, that's kind of the snacks that I leave for the spiders is flies, so they don't know any different. gonna stand in the middle of the road and shoot. You're not me. Get up there. Get down. Good boy.
try to... No, I can't. My hands don't work right. I can't do that. Please, please come on up there. No, no, no. You're not going to sneak around that little corner and take pop shots at me. Uh, at least you made it to the top. Good job. Yeah. Alright, now we switch over to our express ammo. Hope everybody's enjoying the kind of casual stream today. Having some fun. Tomorrow, yeah, tom yeah, tomorrow I'm going to be doing a double stream. Be doing some Red Dead in the morning and then doing some Fallout 76 in the afternoon. And for the Red Dead stream, I may actually be uh, showcasing some DRB. The Dakota River being mod. It just depends if anybody wants to join me in Red Dead. If anybody wants to join up in the posse tomorrow, then I'll be playing like PS4 Red Dead. Oh, we got some live ones. I'm not regretting this. Are you regretting this? Dun -da -dun -da -da.
Oh, darn it. Gotta get a headshot on it. Not doing too bad. Oh, what's he got? A shotgun? Come on in, guys. Come on in. Only seven more. We're doing good. Got him in the head. I'm gonna put my ears on a necklace. Well, I just ain't hear hearing that. Where's this guy? You're dead. Alright, this will put us on round, what, five? Nice! That's actually going kind of decent today. Dun, 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 dun. Not trying to whistle for my horse. 
In the middle of a cloud of arms? Ain't stupid. Now I'm dead. Oh, okay. Because you said that a while ago and that hasn't happened yet. I don't need saving. It's you. You're the one that needs saving. Take your little head out. Come on. You know you want to run across right in front of me. My end is near. Well, I hope so. It should be on my backside where it's always been. Sleek enough, but it was a good shot. Oh, I am. What about you? I get the feeling that these boys just are not trying their hardest. Yeah, definitely are not trying their hardest. That's what was hitting me. Anybody else want to come up?
Anybody else? Just starting a small collection of bodies up here. And somehow we survived that. So, any regrets? None yet. What about you? really need better tactics. Where's that last one? Okay, so we got one just hiding somewhere around here. There he is. <laughs> He's just like, nope, I'm not even in this fight. I'm just walking around. This is going to be fun. We have no alleys left.
that we're not gonna survive this. You are. Say hello to Jesus for me. I will if I ever get there. But you first. It's a stand. It's a Mexican stand now. Anybody else want to try that dumb move? Y'all gotta come up here first. Head back up, buddy. I don't know, are you?
No, I'm not, but you are. Anybody else? Oh, we actually might make it to round seven. Just got one more person. Of course, I'm bad at it, ammo. Let's go find them. Where are you? I think the next round's when we get the wagon. That's when I'll get done again. Got him. That was interesting. This is going to be bad. We probably won't make it past this round. <laughs> oh, shit. At least the wagon didn't kill us. Neither are you. If I go, you're going with me, buddy. I don't take prisoners. I take hostages. For the 
Yeah, bury you face down. Because you're an ass. See you over there. Look at that metal head. Bucket head or whatever it's called. <laughs> yes. Uh, you're really gonna stick just your head up, which is the one thing I like to aim at. Oh, no, 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 you're dead. Fall down already. I ain't dead yet, Emma. But you are. Really? Neither will you, so what's the point?
I don't need to hit. I've taken out 30, like a hundred of y'all. Yes, yes, I would love a bucket head. I knew that was what was going to happen. Whoa, got a little crossfire going on there. Fall off. Somebody finally shot my hand off my head. No, I see what you're doing. We're not doing too bad. I'm trying to figure out who that guy out there he is.
Oh, really? So we only got two guys left, we'll actually make it past round seven. Got one guy left. Made it past round seven. I know, I know. But well, I'm out. I've got ten express rounds left on that. And ten express rounds on that. Yep, yeah, almost out of express. But we did complete the round, so that's the highest I've ever been solo. We're on wave eight. We're definitely, definitely going to die on this one. Soon. Yeah, I don't doubt that I'll be cold dead here pretty soon. But there are a lot better shots on wave 8. Oh, I wouldn't, Bob. You are so much better at this than I am. I, was, I can't free aim or anything, so... I'm not, I'm not a punta. Oh, they come. <laughs> I mean, I have a punta, but I'm not a punta. Oh, yeah, first person makes me sick. Can it? Huh. Oh 
Oh no, you don't. I see you coming up behind me. Ah, damn it. Sorry. <laughs> that was a good one. That was round eight. I will, I will call that a wind. Oh, yeah. I, I definitely do the tonics. Like, I go in with 40 and I come out with, like, two. That was pretty good. My hands finally gave out and I couldn't keep up with it. But I'll call that, I'll call that a win. Yeah, yeah, definitely agreed. Yeah, we're gonna like that one. That was good. But at least I know I'm getting better now. My goal is to get to round 10. It's complete the whole thing solo. Then, then I'll know that I've got some skills. It does, it does. <laughs> well, what I, what I try to do is the first three to four rounds use nothing but regular ammo. That way I can keep refilling it. And then I may have to go up to high velocity for like five and six. And then save the express for a 7 and 10. That and a lot of headshots. Well, luckily, I never fail. I just figure out different ways to do it. But that was, that was pretty good. I mean, considering my record had been, what, round four? And I made it to round six with somebody helping me for part of it. And then I just did round eight rounds by myself. So, yeah, okay, I consider that a win. The Town of Blackwater. Very nice. Back, Look around. Take your time. I am because I gotta rest my hands because they're hurting like crazy. Let's refill on the ammunition. What do you need? Everything. Sell me everything. Good one. You know, I just defended this town. They should at least pay for my ammo. Oh, we got a cell on high velocity. Good one. Uh, no, honestly, I'd have to look. I 
And I, I know I don't have the right ones to be doing it because most of mine are geared towards my bow. Uh, let's see. Uh, quite an inspiration. And hunker down so that I take less damage. I still gotta level that one. A uh, cold blooded, uh, killing the enemy, regain health, and consecutive shot does more damage. So that's the that's the four that I use. I'm still working on leveling that one up. Can I level that one up? Oh, I can. Cause I use cover a lot. Uh, let's see. Yeah, so. Since I use, since I'm constantly using cover, that's why you see me up against stuff but looking away from it. Because it counts as being in cover, so I take less damage. Yeah, I can't upgrade it yet. But since today's a all black day, I can I use guns and I'm completely evil, so I kill everybody. So I don't have to use my bow today. Get out of my way, mister. Yeah, evening. Let's pick us up a bounty real quick. Oh yeah, those are very good ones. And see, uh, I hardly ever use Paint It Black because it's hard for me to press that button to, to activate it. That's why you that's why you don't see me use it a lot. It's because it's hard for me to turn it on. Uh, let's pick up a of bounty. All right, let's see what we got here. Turner Watts. Wanted for public disturbance of the peace and the murder of several patrons in Valentine. Last seen fleeing the scene. Benjamin Bennett. Wanted for the murder of four laborers in Scarlet Meadows. I thought we captured him before. So he just keeps getting away. <laughs> right. Well, I've got I want to figure out a way if I could remap Dead Eye to a different button, I'd probably use it a lot more. Oh, okay. Is that the name of the card that does that? No. <laughs> oh, you're not getting away, Benjamin. You're trying to run. You're gonna you're gonna die tired.
Oh wait, I'm still running that freaking uh regular ammo. In just a second, guys. All right. There we go. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, <laughs> absolutely. Okay, where am I taking this to? Uh, that was the wrong body. Hey, buddy. Here, I can just give you a free ride over here. Here. Could you possibly just um, hang out right here? Yeah, like right there. Good guy. Alright guys, I'm gonna pick up a dead body. You don't be shooting at me. Oh well, now you done started it. You lay down. Oh, get your... Anybody else? No, come on, get out here. No, don't be running away. No, you shot at me. Yeah, you did. You, 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 you. Now they can drive a freight train through your chest. <laughs> right. Well, I do declare, good sir, but it appears that you are the wrong corpse I was after. Could you kindly vacate the back of my horse? <laughs> All right, there we go. After much bloodshed and gnashing of teeth, they all died. And I hate to tell him those stripes did not go with those pants. He's definitely not very color coordinated. No fashion sense at all. End of the line. Yep, your Uber has arrived. And... There we go. Shame. Would have been good for morale to see him hang. You can still hang him. Yeah. He just won't flop around as much. Oh, my horse is not happy about that. Calm down. Calm down. It's okay. You're good. I'll quit it. <laughs> no, no, no. If you ever want to do something funny, Bob, go to first person and go down the river towards Manteca Falls. All in first person. Yeah, it's so much fun. All right, let's see. Victoria Weber. Victoria Weber, 42. Knowingly fled, fed her husband and his brother contaminated meat, killing them both. He is now a fugitive and at large. I'm not really seeing a problem in that. Karen Grace. 
wanted for stabbing a sleeping and defenseless officer of the court until he bled to death. That officer presided over the lawful and well-deserved execution of her outlaw father, Brian Grace. Hmm. <laughs> right? Uh, let's see. They'd contaminated me to kill her husband and his brother. Were they rich? Did they have money? Was there a prenup? We don't know the circumstances. Said a sleeping and defenseless officer. Okay, officers have to carry their weapon on them at all times, and therefore, he wasn't defenseless. He chose not to have his defenses. Hey, Dallas. So, I'm going to say that Sharon Grace was the one in the right. So, she shouldn't be wanted, because if he's an officer and he doesn't have his weapon, then that's his own fault. The fact that she let herself get caught because she didn't cook the meat correctly right so that it could be found out to be contaminated. She's sloppy. She's got to go. You can't have sloppy murderers running around. Either you get it right or you go to jail. Now we're off to Down's Ranch. Not to be confused with Up's Ranch. This is Down's Ranch. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Let's actually try and capture this one alive. Exactly. Exactly. And you definitely, a little cumin, a little thyme, some oregano. It'll cover that smell right up and they'll never know. And see, they had technology back here. You know, it was very rudimentary, but they had technology. You take one of the old batteries out of a transistor radio scrape the mercury off of it, put it in the food, untraceable. <laughs> See, I would never store meat in my armpit. Gross. You store it under your boobs and your bra. Everybody knows that. On a cold, dark, and dreary, rainy night, Anaruko rides into the forest after a fugitive on the law. And she wonders. <laughs> They're not here yet. So we're gonna get over here and we're gonna hide inconspicuously in all black right beside this white rock. They will never see me. See, I am completely hidden. Yeah, perfect. Oh, that's cool. That's the best way to hide. It's always in plain sight. Well, see, that's what most people don't realize is back in the Old West, Girls that didn't have really big chests like you see in the movie. That was actually all just food packed in there for later.
You're doing great, hon. Keep it up. Yep, you're doing good. Yep, keep going, keep going. You're doing wonderful. You're doing great. But that hurt. You were doing so great. Next time you kill somebody and you try to feed them food, trust me, arsenic. Okay, arsenic. Yes. There you go. Sleep tight. You're doing great. I'm just going to put you right back here. Now, be careful, hon. He did have Taco Bell earlier, okay? And da -da 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 -da. You trying to steal my bounty? You trying to steal my bounty? What I thought. Y'all saw that guy. He tried to steal my bounty. So did that tree, so did that rock, so did everything else. I'm kidding. Yes. Well, the the ladies I knock out so they can have a peaceful ride. The gentlemen, the gentlemen on the other hand, I leave them awake so I can slap them around during the ride. <laughs> he tried to steal my bounty. You saw him, he looked at me funny. <laughs> of course, I'm wearing all black today, Bob. On all black days, I play dishonorably. All white days, I play honorably. No, no. You saw him. He saw that I was going to go down that road and he tried to cut me off and block me. You saw it. I have an etch a sketch drawing of the exact offense, okay? I mean, for heaven's sakes, my horse, the horse I'm riding is named Cerebus. That should give you a clue. See, she's alive. At least one of the two is alive. Oh, this poor girl still wanted. Hey, nobody come. Okay, well, I guess... Now, I gave her a chance. She didn't make a run for it. Let's go very nicely and politely get her. Blackwater camp. Dang, dang, dang. No, she don't get no horseshoe because she was sloppy in her murder and that is, we don't reward sloppiness. Either you get it right or you go to jail. Or at least put enough clues in 
in the way that make it look like you didn't do it so that you can get away with it. And you know she's not going to get away with that murder because she wasn't riding a white Bronco. Fort Riggs. Very good location for mysteries. Exactly. Either you do it right all the way or you don't do it at all. There are no participation trophies in 1899. Or actually, 1898, but... Oh, am I going to have to look all over Hey Howard George? You're trying to find this person? Better not make me have to look for you long. Actually, Bob, there's a lot of mystery to Fort Riggs. Um, because there's the, uh, there's the phantom light that appears at night inside the schoolhouse. Uh, the fact that the, the, uh, single grave it's outside the camp. Um, actually, in the video I did on Fort Riggs, I actually discovered a lot about it. Uh, excuse the hyperboil. Oh, you're fine. You're fine. Oh, uh, full on peaches. Huh. What girl isn't full on peaches? Let's see, you know something. Did, did you just see a guy come running through here? Huh? It was a girl, actually. Yeah, see, that was a trick question. I asked a guy to see if he'd lie to me. You are lie to me. I would have shoot you. <laughs> I just didn't, I just didn't enjoy uh, mystery hunting. But you also gotta remember, I grew up on the original Scooby-Doo. Yeah, I'm, I know, I'm old. I can't get through there. Hey, service. Da -da -da. Of course. Nope. Thank you. I know, I know, I know. There's a ton of stuff to say that that had time or the inclination to finish all of the storylines out and all the mysteries out. This It'd probably be like double the content. Just like a, the, one of the biggest mysteries, the, the third meteorite. There's actually a hidden clue in the game that you only get if you have 100%. And I've never been able to finish that clue out. Because I got the dialogue and everything. But, of course, I can't find the person to finish it. So. Search the area. I'm not already... Oh, wait. Where's my house? House. Come here, house. House, where are you, house? <laughs> well, IKZ, um, I actually traced IKZ down to St. Denis. Or what I, where I believe she is in St. Denis. Yeah, 
Yes, yeah. If you could catch that legendary catfish, that would be awesome. But isn't it, isn't it kind of funny that a, there's a mystery about a catfish that catfishes us? So the catfish does the catfish? That's funny. Good house. Aha! Uh -huh. You made me look for you, didn't you? Oh, you know it's fixing to happen, don't you? Yeah. See, I could. I could. I, I mean. You're done for! But instead, I'm going to do that. I just wanted to wake her up. Yeah, I know, right? But you can actually track uh, if you put if you put the clues together on IKZ. Excuse me. Uh, it, it led me to Algernon Wasp in Saint Denise, and then Algernon Wasp um, little shop is actually right behind a hotel. And the name of the hotel, it says it in French, but if you translate it to English, it's called the Unicorn Hotel. So it makes perfect sense that she would be at the Unicorn Hotel. Because, you know, unicorn, un uncatchable. Yeah, well, I think... A lot of the content got cut before they could finish it completely out. Because there is a model for the catfish. But it looks really weird. And I think they were just got to a point where it was like, you know, everybody was developing the quest lines like IKZ, Third Meteorite, those storylines. And then they just said, okay, everybody stop, release the game. Yeah. Of course. I'm going to look for your efforts. I think that the, the designers were, you know, working hard at getting the content, getting it ready, and the upper people were like, hey, just everybody stop right where you're at, you know, put a period at the end of it, and let's release the game. We want money. And then after they did that and released one of the baddest games that's come out in a long time, they just never went back and finished it. Oh, yeah. All right, let's see. We've got time for one more thing. So let's go and see one of these annoying out here blood money. Oh, we go talk to Sean. But I think if, if they ever went back and said, hey, we're going to pick up Red Dead 2 and finish stuff out, but we're going to release them as DLCs, I mean, they'd make tons of money off of the DLCs. Because everybody would want to finish the mysteries out because everybody wants to be the person that has that answer. I know uh, one of the videos I've got on my list to do, my, I have a backlog of videos that I should be doing, is, uh, you know, the third meteorite. Um, I don't have an update on K IKZ because there's not really much to update. There's not much there. Um, I know uh, Blam Double Oaks put me onto an idea that I've got on my log to do. That is a freaking amazing connection. Uh, jailbreak. What's this? Your mission. I want mission. 
put your hunting skills to the test and track down dangerous predators. Or break known criminals out of prison. Oh yeah, I agree, Bob. I agree. Definitely. If they if they remastered it and released them together. Yeah. Let's go break somebody out of jail. Today's a dishonorable day. By the way, you ever meet Phineas Moss? No, I haven't. Nice boy he is. Oh, oh okay. Then why are you talking about him? Shame if he got himself hanged. Ah. Order he's up on. Murder charges. Order? It's bad because I reckon he did do it, but I also reckon the bastard he murdered. Deserved killing. Oh, okay. Well, I know this because it was his brother he murdered, and whereas you wouldn't find a kinder fella than Phineas. Oh, okay. Was a real sack of shit. Really? I won't bore you with the details. Thank you. Could you do me a real favor if you could say Phineas for me? Okay. Anyways, you haven't seen a strange bunch about. There are twenty-five of them, men and women. If you do see them, you let me know. <laughs> okay. So we're breaking a guy out of prison or jail that killed his brother because his brother was in a butt munch and he's a nice fellow but he's one that did the killing. Um, yeah, tomorrow I will because I will be doing another call to arms. Um, I'm not going to do another one today. But yeah, tomorrow I'll actually have run open posse and anybody can join that wants to join. And what is trying to eat me? Is that a cougar? That's a cougar. And another cougar. Okay, couple of cougars. So way to start a mission off. See, that's a good theory, Bob. Or Rocky. Um, except for one thing. If you get 100% completion on the game. And you stand in Valentine. You'll overhear a guy talking to another guy. About how his daughter found a strange rock in a pond. And, and has it. And, and kept it. So the pond, I think it's Moonstone Pond. And the guy's daughter in Valentine has the meteorite. But I don't know if they put her in the game. Because maybe you're supposed to go talk to her. And trade something to get it. Or buy it from her or something. Alright, Bob. You have a good one. Thank you. That is a good theory about the eagle, though. I may have to go try that just to check it out. Whoa! Hey, how you doing, police officer person? Oh, there's cops. Shoot her in the face, maybe. <laughs> Alright, so I've got to enter the police department. There's cops everywhere. If I were you, I'd be using my last words for prayer. He got what's coming to him. Oh, this is not gonna be good. Bye, Bob. At least we're dressed appropriately. I 
don't want the law to leave us alone. It definitely be interesting to look at. I mean, I've got a save file right before that I went to the Eagle's Nest, so I can go check that out. And of course, it could just be rocks or catfishing all of us by purposely leaving um, mysteries open ended. Yeah, but at least you get a gun. Yeah, we are so far until they find us again. You know, for somebody that's supposed to have been, you know, so innocent, he's holding, he, I mean, he's got that gun trained. So he's not scared to use it. Oh no, we killed an innocent rabbit. Can't be doing that, we're white hair. Do you think we lost them? Are you sure? Oh boy, this air tastes good. It's good to be free. <laughs> That's my posse up there. <laughs> I'll be damned. <laughs> His posse. Thanks for getting me back out of there. I owe you. Good news. He's supposed to be a brother that innocently killed his brother, and he's got a posse. Yes, as long as it wasn't a white hair. Where's my house? Where's my house? Where's service? All right, everybody. I hope everybody had fun today. That was actually a pretty good little casual stream. And we did not kill a white hair. <laughs> but I am going to call it a day there. I've got to get ready so I can head out of town. But I will be streaming all day tomorrow. So I hope everybody's around to catch it. And we will have some more discussions. But everybody have a great day. Don't forget to hit the like button. And don't forget to check out my latest video on the Strange Man where I compare the Strange Man to God and the Devil in a very casual, theological way. So don't forget to check that out. And as always, everybody have a great day. Remember, 
when you're chasing rabbits, be very careful because they've got very small rabbit holes and we've got very big heads. So don't get stuck in there. But until tomorrow, everybody have a great day. Bye-bye.